Good afternoon. Four more New Mexico counties can now reopen elementary schools for hybrid learning. That includes schools in Gallup just months ago, months after the city was on lockdown, making national news as coronavirus cases raced through the area. Let's get to News 13's Jackie Kent. Jackie. Lizzie, the city now has a less than 5% test positivity rate. A school board member says they're ready to welcome students back to class on Monday. We have so many students that um, aren't able to get internet connection. So at least they will be able to come to the school, download their, their work, and, and take it home. Gallup McKinley schools will welcome half of elementary students on Mondays and Tuesdays, the other half on Wednesdays and Thursdays, and all kids will learn virtually on Fridays. But of course, families can opt to continue distance learning from home. This reopening is a big leap in the right direction when compared to this scene in Gallup for about 10 days in early May. The city making national headlines as big orange cones and state police blocked visitors from coming into the city. More than four months later, the Department of Health's latest map shows McKinley County has moved into the green zone, meeting the criteria to reopen under the hybrid model because of improving average daily case rates and test positivity numbers. The Public Education Department says the goal is to keep schools from opening and closing if case numbers spike in any county, so the PED and Health Department are always monitoring county conditions. It will be up to the health experts, not the education experts, to determine when uh, it is no longer safe for those students to go to school. The other three counties getting the go-ahead this week for the hybrid model include Hidalgo, Doña Ana, and Curry counties. Now, the PED has to sign off on re-entry plans for the school districts in those counties, or they can stick with online learning for the semester like Las Cruces has. Let's say back to you. Okay, Jackie. 24 other New Mexico counties got the same permission from the PED last week.